first, we apologize because this is definitely going to make you check your bathroom again. But Bill and Kimberly Coward never thought they'd have to until they saw those beady little eyes staring back at them. There's something about unexpected visitors right there. showing up where you're most vulnerable. I don't know, around 10 o'clock or so, I just went to go use the bathroom and I washed my hands and I flipped the lid and I just see this thing started trying to get out. <laughs> This toilet in Bill and Kimberly Coward's house, and inside, a rat. I screamed like a little girl, and I just slammed the thing shut and uh, flushed away. <laughs> As we would all probably do, the rat was flushed back down to the sewer where it came from, and Bill and Kimberly started learning way more about rats than they ever wanted to know. That big, not a huge rat, but uh, it was definitely black like the Norwegian rats that I guess are more of the sewer rats. <laughs> we've done our yeah. research. Yeah, we've done our research. <laughs> the first thing they learned, this isn't rare. Actually, it is, a, it is a pretty routine thing in our industry. Victor Diaz with Smart Pest Solutions says your sewage system isn't actually full of water. And there are vent lines in your roof, places where rats can crawl. And once they hit your toilet, they really only have to swim through about six inches of water. Rodents can't hold their breath, and um, they're actually pretty proficient swimmers, and most people don't give them enough credit for it. So just like any other pest, you need to seal up the holes, cracks, and vents around your house to keep them out. Luckily, it's in another bathroom, so <laughs> I could have avoided it. That's what Bill and Kimberly are doing, as well as making sure there are no unexpected visitors in the bathroom. You can also try to make your house less attractive to rats. You can put away your trash, make sure it's gone, make sure there's no hiding spots for them. They can sneak into holes no bigger than a quarter. William Pitts, 12 News.